Hey everyone, here's our math problem for today. Let's say we are given this circle and inscribed in a circle is an equilateral triangle ABC and inscribed in that equilateral triangle is another circle that is concentric to the original circle. It is given that the area of the red circle is 210 square centimeters and we would like to find what is the area of the larger circle in this figure. You can pause the video and see if you can solve this interesting geometry challenge. Now let's solve this problem together. Let's begin by locating the center of the two circles that are concentric. Then since the triangle is an equilateral triangle, that means all the angles of the triangle is 60 degrees. Let's label the center as center O. Let's construct this right triangle AOD where O is the center of the red circle and point D is the point of tangency between the red circle and this line segment AC, forming this right angle ODA. So segment OD is the radius of the red circle. Since this angle here is bisected by segment AO, this means that the angle formed here is equal to 30 degrees. And since this is 90, it implies that this central angle here is equal to 60 degrees. So we have a 30, 60, 90 triangle. Now let's recall some properties of a special 30, 60, 90 triangle. In this 30, 60, 90 triangle, if the length of the side opposite the 30 degree angle is x, then the hypotenuse of this right triangle is twice the length of this side, which is 2x. Applying that in our yellow triangle, if the length of the side opposite this 30 degree angle is r, it follows that the hypotenuse AO is twice this r or 2r. Then from here, we can now form this equation. The area of the red circle is of course equal to pi r squared, where its radius is represented by the variable r. On the other hand, the area of the larger circle is equal to pi times its radius squared, but the radius of the larger circle is now 2r, which is this 2r. Simplifying, this is equal to 4 pi r squared, because 2 squared is this 4, r squared is this red r squared, and we just copy the pi. 4 is a constant, pi is a constant. If we can find the value of r squared, then we already know what is the area of the larger circle. But from the first equation here, we can solve this for r squared by dividing both sides by pi to get r squared is equal to 210 over pi. And this r squared now can be substituted to whatever is the variable here, which is also r squared. We can replace that with the value 210 over pi, and therefore, we now arrive at 4 pi replace r squared by 210 over pi, which is this value here. Simplifying, we can cancel out this pi and this pi, and so 4 times 210 is 840, and the unit is centimeter squared, because this is now the area of the larger circle. And so for our final answer, the area of this larger circle is 840 square centimeters, 